we are about to begin the dousing rod session. We've had some success with the Phasma Box and Spirit Box software. We have had interactions throughout the night with both the periscope slightly and with the lights. So we do believe that we have made contact of something. Now what I'm about to do is a dousing rod session. This is not something that I would ever recommend somebody new to the realm of the paranormal ever get involved with. This is only something that experienced investigators should try to do at their own risk. So please do not attempt this at home unless you have experience with this type of stuff. So we're going to be conducting the Dowson Rod session. straight. Yep. Is there a soldier we've come in contact with? There's a soldier. Can you please touch my left arm? There's a soldier here. You were talking to us. Can you please touch my left arm? I guess a no. If you're a woman, can you please touch my left arm? If you're a woman, I'm going to close my eyes. If you're a woman, can you please touch my left arm? If you're a woman, can you please touch my left arm? Use both those rods to touch his left arm. If you're a woman, please touch my left arm. It looks like they're touching on my end. There you go. You saw me. I didn't move, right? Nope, you didn't move. I know I moved, but I, that didn't I, do anything. I wasn't moving. Yeah, you're good. Are you buried in the graveyard? If you're buried in the graveyard, can you point towards Ryan? Oh, you smell something? No, what do you smell? Something putrid. Buried in the graveyard, can you please point forward? Ooh. Can you straighten out both those rods if you're buried in the graveyard? Oh, wow. Is your grave marked? If your grave is marked, can you please touch my left, my, I'm sorry, my right arm? So can you please touch my right arm if your grave is marked? You smell that? No. You don't smell anything, Kip? It just smells something terrible. You don't smell this. No. If your grave is unmarked, if we can't find your grave, can you touch my right arm? Can't touch your, if we can't find your grave, can you touch my right arm? Are you in the house next door? If you're coming from the house next door, can you please cross the rods? If you're coming from the house next door, can you please cross the rods? Thank you. So I'm gonna talk real quick. We have two, op I mean, two possible names. It's either Emily or Sally. Um, I found out that Emily's actually buried in the graveyard here. Really? Yep. And Emily's the one that looks after Sally, according to Richard Ellsworth. Emily, can you please touch my left arm with one of the rods, or both? Emily? Emily, please touch my left arm. Okay, to confirm that we are speaking with Emily, can you straighten out those rods and point them directly at me, please?
Point those rods at me if you're Emily. Okay. 